But, yeah. That's funny. So that pissed me off to no end. So I might I might sell it to Tim. I'm not sure yet. I might oh, well, sell it to Tim. At least Tim would know what they're saying. <laughs> yeah. It's just like. <laughs> Nowhere did in any because usually on like Amazon or GameStop or stuff it'll tell you it's you you can live live the full experience in subtitled full voiceover Japanese bullshit which uh. I'm like usually pass because to me it's hard to get into a story where I don't understand a fucking word yeah you're but you also yeah. like. Well, Japanese also, voices to you is also one of like the, the funniest you type, you? one of the funniest sounding well, things in the world. It, it, really lacks, it lacks the 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 narrative emotion basically is what the problem is too is that we we don't have a context for it so therefore it takes out the whole emotion of like the voice actor and yeah like the, the scene and the story and, and stuff so yeah, to me it does. it's just very difficult for me to but yeah, then again I for don't. me years of watching subtitled anime and mm -hmm. yeah see i don't it, that would irritate me like because like yeah you're right i do find their voices very funny <laughs> <laughs> All the guys sound the same in them for the most part. It, it sounds terrible to say, but they kind of do to me. They all go, that's, and they, they all say, that's, like, that's really racist. It's not racist. It's, no, I'm I making know. an observation. <laughs> I know, I know <laughs> but that's what it sounds like to me. So it's like it's hard to get into it when, especially, and I, I think I made this point in, um, I was playing Tokyo Mirage Sessions for the, the Wii U. Mm -hmm. I, that's one of the few Japanese only voice games that I've actually liked. But was that one just like a visual novel? No, God no. It, it it played like Persona. It was the Persona Fire Emblem crossover. Oh, okay. Sorry, I was thinking. Uh, yeah, yeah you're, you're thinking Lux Pain. That's probably it. That was a good one actually, and that that one I think was in English. But that one, it's like yeah, I I kind of forced myself to play past that fact that it was only in Japanese or whatever. But they they say stuff like flavor text in battle and stuff, and they don't subtitle that. So I'm like, what the fuck are they talking about? Like, I don't understand any of what they're saying. So it just kind of, it takes me out of the experience. I don't know. Yeah, it no, it kind of drives me nuts. Yeah, that's a bummer. Um, Tales of Hearts R for the, the Vita, they did the same thing. It's another one where if it's supposed to have a deep story to it, I, I can't get into it if I don't understand what they're saying. Mm -hmm. So it just, it kind of drives me nuts. If you're gonna bring it here, bring it here. Like that's that's the way I feel about it. Don't half-ass it. Just bring it here. And you can't. A, a, a company like Nicholas, they could have done voiceover work. There's really no excuse that they could. You know. I don't know. No, but, you're you're right. You're right. Yeah. Kevin brought up a good point that maybe the voice acting for or the voiceover localization and stuff like that owned by... might have been owned by Atlas. Oh. So maybe that was their that was their their so you say trade put shield down. or whatever. But they never do. You have to hit him from the other side. Yeah, he does. <coughs> it's just he could. <clears throat> so like that, I can understand. But then why wouldn't you just do it again? Like. Yeah. I don't know. It really irritated. And I was really pissed because that was technically a birthday present. And it's like, damn it, now I'm, now I'm upset. Now you're out of birthday present. No, it's just, I feel bad wasting it. And, oh, and yeah. just kind of, I don't know, I have mixed feelings about it. But like I said, you might want to kill that guy. Yeah, I forgot about those ones. Yeah. So that guy, eventually he'll do, uh, he'll summon an ice storm that hits the entire screen and there's no way out of it. Oh. Yeah. Oh, cool. Well, there's one way. Although I suppose if you turn into a mist, there's a way out of it, but... I love his death. Oh, that's cool. Oh, yeah, he jazzes. He, he straight jazzes. The only enemy in this game where the cat eye circlet actually heals you. Hmm. Because they're the only enemies that turn into cats. Mm, did it. No, I'm thinking if there was another enemy that can heal you with it, but yeah, oh. I think you're right. Oh, yeah. Dude. Spikes! Oh, yeah, that's right. I was like, boy, you're just walking right into it without giving a fuck, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Lots of spikes. But other than that, there's a few things I'm looking forward to playing. Dead Cells is out already, but I'm waiting for my physical copy, which that should be cool. Um, Dragon Quest XI comes out next month, which will be awesome. Obviously, World Ends With You comes out in October, which I'm super fucking pumped for. Yeah. So, I don't know. There's a lot I'm, I'm looking forward to playing, but for right now, yeah, Chasm and uh, 
Octopath have been taking up my time. What about you, Kevin? I know you're very, very excited for your Spider-Man. Yeah. When does that come out? September 7th. Mm. I've been hearing so much about it. Mm. So what's that one supposed to play like? You know, like Spider-Man 2 on PS2. Okay. But obviously much better because it's, uh... What is it, Insomniac doing it? Whatever. The company that's doing it is really well known for really good quality games. So. Really? Yeah. That's cool. Uh, uh, I'm and sure. then Darksiders 3 when that hits, because I've oh, got that yeah. special edition ordered. And Darksiders 3 is That's going to cool. fucking hurt when that one comes out. They're still sticking with the whole like Zelda theme, right? Yeah. Both, one and two were both yeah. Zelda clones, right? Mm. Yeah, two had more open worlds. Um, this one's supposed to have, I guess, supposedly a bit more freedom in how you do stuff, but I don't know. Really? Yeah, so, I don't know, we'll see when it comes out. <laughs> That'll be cool. And I know you're getting, yeah, you're getting the collector's thing, so obviously we're going to be doing box openings for those. Oh, that's gonna be, oh. yeah, that's when that one. comes out of my wallet, that's going to hurt. <laughs> how much is that one? Okay, so the version I got is called the Apocalypse Edition. Comes with four full statues that are like 10 inches. So think the MVC4, yeah. or MVC Ultimate yeah. kind of collection. And then what else? Um, comes with a wall scroll, uh, steelbook case, I think, like a soundtrack. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's like $500. <laughs> it's a bitch. Yeah, but those statues nice. are... Those statues alone, they retail for about somewhere between 70 and 100. And it is really cool stuff, too. Like, the artwork for that series is amazing. It's all Joe Mad. Yeah, so. yeah. Joe Mad era. What comes with the Spider-Man one? The Spider-Man statue. I like the season pass. Um, I know you get some content early. Mm -hmm. Like, it's some costumes are just... The Spider Punk costume, Spider Man Noir, and the Velocity costume. So oh, that's cool. The story that they're doing is it more so like a it's their own original story. Oh, is oh, okay. Um, it starts off with I guess you fighting Fisk, and then eventually the next boss is like uh, Mr. Negative. Mm, okay. He's never been in a game before. Oh, this yeah. place sucks. Um, God, everything's then, always cold here. And Mr. Then, Mr. Uh, Negative, get it. <laughs> hey, wait, Kevin's essentially our Mr. Negative. Everything oh, sucks and nothing's good you, enough. I am very positive. <laughs> uh, um, okay. You shut up, Kevin. <laughs> okay. I gotta get something to drink. I'll be right back. Talk amongst yourselves, um, Barry. But then I guess, yeah, Sinister Six are gonna be in it, but they've only revealed five of them. Okay. So we're not sure if Doc Ock, Sandman, or... Someone else might be the, the other one. The other ones? Okay, gotcha. Um, we know Norman Osborn is in there, but we don't know if he's Green Goblin yet at this point. Because mm -hmm. I guess according to the story, Peter's been Spider-Man for like eight years. So he's been Spider-Man for at least a little while. Okay. And yeah, so I don't know. It looks really good to me, though. Like the quality just looks amazing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, the web swinging is back to being like a physics-based thing, so it actually attaches to buildings and oh, it just looks really okay. good. Yeah, no, it's like I said. And, I've been I, and to be honest, the design for their suit, I love it. Mm -hmm. I don't understand why people don't like it. I've been seeing a lot of stuff and a lot of talk about that that game, um, so I'm just very surprised. Uh, Pop, which boss is this? Did I just save? Yeah, you did. Okay, you did. I think this is Gallimau. Oh. No. Uh -oh. Coming back to Gallimau, huh? I think this is Gallimau. Yeah, it is Gallimau. He's easy. Done. Hey, don't you have the barrel, sir? I do. Why is lightning not healing me? Heals HP by lightning. Oh, that might not be the right lightning. Oh, like that. It's me. Charles Witness. It could be. It might be those women. Oh my God. <laughs> He's so easy. And now. Damn, I didn't know you could stun lock. Because he's stuck in the wall. Oh. No, the one it's, it's the one where he this holds out the mace and, and it yeah, rains the lightning on you. I think that's what heals you. Jesus oh. Christ, he's got a lot of light. I yet. told you, even with this, he's not easy. No, he's, uh, no, he's easy. He just takes a little bit of time. 
Are you kidding? Try to fight this fucker with the red rust. Oh, fuck that. I, the only time I ever really fought him was with, uh... It does, does, I probably doesn't hurt that I'm only doing 23 ahead. Holy crap, though. That's he's got cool. the most life of any boss in the game. Yeah, he's got more than Dracula. He's like the super boss for the game. Go fuck yourself. And after all that, I get some bullshit like life up. Yeah, you don't even get anything good from him. Because I think all it is is a poison mist. Yeah, like, who gives a shit? Life max up, well. Yeah, that barrel circle did a whole lot of fucking nothing, didn't it? Yep. Yeah, but he's still dead. Nice. He is, and it goes towards your overall percentage, so be thankful. Yeah, fuck you, Paul. Damn, dude, you must have gotten a few level ups from that. When the hell did you have 600 fucking life? Weren't you just at, like, 480-something? No, he was yet? at 560-something. Was he? Yeah, you just weren't paying attention. Yeah, I guess not. Yeah. We yeah. were busy talking about Mr. Negatives and all yeah. sorts of stuff. No, you were busy talking about uh, that, that game that you hate. <clears throat> Yeah, that could be too. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, the end of this year is going to be expensive. Beginning of next yeah. year is going to be expensive. It's true. Anthem, yeah. Division 2. Yeah, no, beginning of next year is going to be expensive for me because, like you said, buying a PS4. So. Yeah, Resident Evil. See, you're, you're at a good spot, though, where you're buying it to where it's now... There's enough flush. of a library. There's enough of a library. It's flushed out, so they, like, the, they worked a lot of the bugs out of it. The, and you're going to get one with a great memory. Like, oh, yeah. I, see, I had to buy an external because I have a one terabyte system and I still have an external. Yeah, yeah. but don't they go up to two now? Aren't it's they only one. It's only like one or two. Yeah, oh. but I have an external that's four and it's half full already. I don't see how. Well, that's right. You buy a lot of digital though. I really. Well, don't. and and games like uh, you went all the way left already, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, games like Ghost Recon, I think it's almost 100 gigs on its own. No, see, I would never play games like that anyway, so... Well, Ghost Recon Wildlands wow. is, uh... <laughs> just... Don't, just... Don't hit here. What are you let's, doing? Let's see who was knocking at my door. What are you doing? Keith, don't... What the... F oh, it's an election I'm thing. I came by today because your neighborhood has been chosen to participate in a study on voter voter turnout. Oof. Yeah, that would have been rough. Wait a minute, Keith Demesic. I don't know who that is. He's a. No, Keith Demesic is a. He's our alderman, isn't he? One of the no, aldermen. Oh, he's a police officer. Um, or he was a police officer. There is a police officer that lived here many, many years ago in this house. Oh, Apparently, maybe it was Keith. His sister came to our rum and sale. Oh. And so that he used to live here. He was an average with the garage. Oh, wow. Oh. He was the drug dealer. Yeah, right. <laughs> it was the guy before the drug dealer. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, whatever. That's ironic. <laughs> Speaking of drugs, I found drugs everywhere. I know, that's what I was like. You found drugs? Where she was okay. like, oh no, he's a cop. And I was like, oxycodone, like, hydrocodone. Drug <laughs> Opioids. Yeah. And she was like, oh no, 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 that was the guy after. <laughs> awesome. <clears throat> Where are you straight. going? I gotta go back up. Oh. I've already gone to the left. I had to go to that one door to the right. And... Slice! Sorry, it still reminds me of that, that Joe Coy one. <laughs> oh. Cage Slash! Cage and Slash. I don't know why I made you do that. <laughs> I don't know why either, because you're an idiot. Guess what? I'm just berserker clawing everyone. Berserker Craw! Royal! X Men or Street Fighter? No? Play that one. Oh, his his yeah, souped-up computer a, fan. I bought a fan uh, the other week. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's as good as it gets. <laughs> it's like a fucking computer it fan is. in a box. It's a 120 millimeter computer fan. It's terrible. It was only like ten dollars. Why did you? Why did you? Get I told it? him not to. Because I thought it would help. Because we had to fix his bit. toilet. We had to fix my toilet. Because uh, so we went to the, we went to like three different stores to find the parts. You do realize if you got like a like a, a like a full size like pedestal fan that would have yeah for twenty bucks. Is yeah, it? My toilet still doesn't work. Yeah. Fuck stop it. breaking it. Yeah, really. No, I think it's just the, it's fine. Fuck it. If I if if I do that if I have to fix it again, maybe I'll buy that one we saw for the other the American Standard one with the washers from the top and the bottom. Maybe that'll work better. Yeah, I forgot. You're ducking when you land. If you get stuck in it, I can't finish moving after that. I hate that. Oh, I see where you're talking. Okay. 
You're just gonna continue your path around? Down, yeah. Down to the... That's why the reverse castle is awesome, is because you can kind of traverse this in any fucking order, and you can... Yeah, it, right. It's so much quicker than the actual castle. Right. Like the first castle. I see the other thing I like is like the bosses become normal enemies. Slow gra. When do you meet fast gra? Ha 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 ha. Paul is so funny. Now I remember why we don't put him on. Yeah. 